Hey folks, Randy with Pizza RV TV here today. Another quick tip segment for you. Yeah, I took a phone call the other day while I was in the service department waiting for something and uh, it was a gentleman that was having problems with his hot water heater. Uh, he said that uh, he had a flare up and now it was not lighting anymore. So I asked him a couple questions and we were able to narrow it down very quickly. And there was a way to avoid uh, what happened to him. So that's what I'm gonna talk about a little bit today. Um, in your hot water heater, on any coach um, we've got a gas valve um, we have where the gas comes out here out of the orifice we have our air mixture and the flame happens back here um, what can happen when these things sit around a little and I've even had it happen while it was sitting on my pad um, over the period of about six hours um, a bug can get in here either a spider or a mud dauber or something that likes to build a nest or have a web and they crawl in here they like the smell of the LP they get in here and build a little nest what that does is obstruct the flow of our LP and when that happens is the LP comes back out here where the air mixes it can't get through this tube properly and with the cover closed it starts to back up in here a little bit and it'll actually have a small flare up now there is protective devices to compensate if there is a flare up there's this little guy right here if any heat gets to it um, it'll actually melt and it'll shut the gas off so nothing to worry about safety wise but if you're a camping um, and we have a little flare up and we lose this we've got no hot water heater for the weekend and we definitely don't want that um, so best thing to do we sell them in our store pizza rv store online pizzarvparts.com I'm gonna put a cover over this. That won't allow the bugs to get in here, to go in down there and build the nest, get into that tube, um, obstruct the flow of our gas, or we're gonna have issue. This thing will not light if it doesn't have a good gas flow um, and the air mixture. So it'll just back up a little bit. We might get some sooting up the side of our coach. Again, not hugely dangerous. It can be dangerous, but uh, if you keep it covered, um, something like this over the top, we won't let the bugs to get in. That's a great way to go. Um, they also have them available for the furnaces. So we can cover that area there. And they make them to do the refrigerator vents as well. Every one of these devices does have LP gas and we do have a direct spark ignition to it. So if we can keep the critters out from building a nest in there to obstruct our gas flow, we're not gonna have any issues on the camping trip. I know I don't like to have issues when I'm camping and I bet you don't either. So this is a good preventative measure. None of these things are very expensive, but it will ensure that we have a great camping experience and we won't have any problem with any of these systems. So thanks again for watching Pete's RV TV with Randy today. Again, all these things can be found on our online store, PeteSRVParts.com. Come check us out there. Nate's always got some great specials going on there. Um, thanks for watching Pete's RV with Randy today and happy camping.